Hello and welcome back to another series of BPM to Fame Season 3. But this time, it's going to be your BPM account. That's right, this is the viewer's BPM to Fame, where we'll be spending 20 hours on one lucky person's account over a course of 20 days. That is an hour a day for 20 days. So let's get into the video. So here we are, guys, on our first viewer's account, where we will be running... 20 hours on this account one hour a day for 20 days and he does have 1.5 mil that's a lovely starting budget let's have a quick look at his club his name is Peratia. i think i'm saying it right if i'm not then i'm a big fraud but let's have a look at his club um he does have a nice looking team um he does have team of the year allison in goal he does have the 98 rated Adapo or Doppo at the back, which he paid 9,700 coins for. This is a bronze card right here as well. This is what makes this account so special. 98 rated. It was a bronze card. Oh, my days, man. I'm loving this already. Um, we've got Saliba. Quality. First owner as well. He's got first owner Maldini. Um, first owner Hernandez playing at left mid. Love that card as well. Uh, first owner, Modric, Umbriel. He has 92 Zidane, uh, first owner. Right mid, he's got Valverde, which is obviously not the formation that he plays in-game, I'm going to say. Um, love that as well. We've got first owner, Mo Salah. First owner, Didier Drogba. And he is upgrading Athena's future star card. That is a lovely team. I like that. And I'm going to assume... That all these are first. Oh no, maybe not. Okay, eighty-eight. <laughs> hey, you got you got to love it. You've got to love it. He's grinded this account. I I'm glad that this has landed on Paratir because, yeah, he's a he's a grinder, boys. He's a grinder and he's a viewer. He knows what he's doing. It it's lovely. It's lovely to see. Um, Havertz there as well. Yeah, look at these man. Sergio. He's even upgraded Sergio Ramos. Oh. What what a club. He does have he does have Blanc and I absolutely hate this card because this card destroys me week in, week out on foot champs. It's just one of the most OP and this card. These two at the back, yeah, are just stupid. Now obviously gold VVD has kind of gone out of meta. Um it is more is upgraded cards now. Um Alvaro as well. Who's this? I don't even know. I've never even heard of this boy. Um and then another Indian player. Fair play, man. We gotta love this. We gotta love this. Um, so it's a 91 rated squad, looking pretty nice. Um, let's go and have a look. He is in the middle of doing his Evo as well. We're gonna leave that to him to do. Uh, we are gonna go and have a look at um let's have a look at the transfer list, boys. Is there anything on here? We might need to use this. Oh, he does have some players on here. Um he does have one, two, three, four. He has a few bronze players on here already. Um, okay, he only has five pages. So we've got a bit of room to go and sell some bronzes if we need to. Um, not too bad, boys. Not too bad. Let's have a little look at the club in terms of bronze players. He's got one, two, three. His, his club stocked. His club is stocked with bronzes, boys. It makes our life a lot easier in terms of what we need to do on the account. Um, and to be honest, we're probably going to limit a lot of the time for him because he probably ends up doing daily challenges every single day to go and get his bronze packs, his silver packs and his daily gold packs. Um, so we're going to limit his time on that for about the hour period, which is lovely to see. Um, yeah, his club stocked, boys. Look, we're on, we're on 35 pages and we haven't even touched 62 rated cards yet. So it is a good club. Well, let's have a look at his silvers. His silvers are looking pretty good as well, boys. We have got a stocked account to deal with here. Um, now, why is this a challenge? Because a lot of you guys out there are going to be thinking, well, I've got a good club. I've got this type of club as well. I don't need to do BPM, which may be the case. And if that's the case and you don't need to do BPM, we've got to do something with in BPM. So whether that's complete SBCs, um, 
and then move towards bigger packs to try and get better players into your club. It's, it's as simple as that. So I'm going to be showing you the, the next steps, basically. Page 40, and we're on to 70 rated cards. We've got a load more cards in the club to go and do. Um, so we're going to start off with this episode um, by opening up one bronze pack, if we can. Let's see. We've got to start off with a bronze pack, right, boys? So here we go. Let's see if he's got this player in his club. Polish. Hey, uh, I can't lie to you, yeah? But he doesn't have every single card in his club because we have just pulled four men that do not even hit his club. Hey, we love that. Right, so standard procedure. Go and get rid of all of the um, consumables that don't really sell. You can go and compare price, but I know that these don't sell. Um, even the Livingston kit for any Scottish Livingston fans out there, I do apologise, but we do have to quick uh, quick sell it. Um, and we are just going to go and check the price on these. Now, there's something that has happened over the past day with Bronze Rares. Bronze Rares, boys, were selling at 500 coins last night. Well, unfortunately, we was going to start this account last night, but... We had internet issues, so we've had to start it today. And I think they are down to about 250, maybe 300 coins on a, an automatic sell. But we will go and find out when we get one. So let's try and find ourselves a rare. There we go. And again, we've got another four players. What's going on? Hey, we're cooking. Right, we are going to continue to open up a few bronze packs. Um, yeah, so he has gone down there to 250, as you can see. Um, the insta sell was, like I said, 300 coins. Going on to 500 coins last night. So... They have gone down a little bit, which is a little bit sad. Hopefully, they do release something in the next coming days where they will start to sell. And then you can make a lot of your coins back. Great. So, we are going to continue to stock into the club unless they are selling. Well, as you can see, this card is also not selling. Uh, this card is also not selling. And this card is also not selling. So, we will continue to stock them into the club. We do get Craven Cottage, which sometimes does sell for a nice cheeky 1k profit or something. I don't know. But as you can see here... It is not selling. It is at 300 coins to 200 coins. So we are just going to go and quick sell that. I'm going to say 200 coins. Um, the football here, 200 coins as well. Get rid of that. Bang. Put them into the club, boys. Uh, so that's a little bit disappointing that obviously bronze rares are not selling. But it is what it is. It is what it is. Let's continue. Yo, b -boss. Um, Beast, how are we, man? What's happening, Jenny? How are we, Pips, as well? Hope we are well. Um, this manager is not selling. But what we're going to do with all the managers, um, this player obviously not selling. Carlisle kit won't be selling, I'm telling you now. Let's have a little look, though. Yeah, 200 coins. So there are a few kits and a few... Oh, hang on a minute. No. Okay, there are a few kits. There are a few banners as well, right? There's a red banner that was selling yesterday for 3,000 coins. So we do need to go and check stuff like that as well. Um, the red... In... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get rid. I thought so. Um, so we do have a player here. I am going to try and sell it. You know, we always try to sell our players. If they don't sell, just put them into um, an upgrade SBC. It's better off to get the money. Lag, sir, his name was as well. That is literally gameplay right there, boys. Lab, sir. Now, what I'm going to do with the managers when we open up these packs, I'm going to store all the managers into the clubs. Because if you don't know and you haven't been following me, um, and you haven't been following me on Twitter or anything like that, we kind of... When certain players come out in packs or whatever that are off off nation, let's go and say, uh, let's think Australians, right? Australian player, um, let me think, a Switzerland player, right? They're off nation. They're not your popular nations. Then what will happen to the manager cards? They will all of a sudden go bang. And we will do a list for it on uh, Twitter and we'll post out on Twitter. We've got the Livingston kit again. That's mad. Um, so, yeah, sometimes um, these... Manager cards will boom up in price and you can go and sell them. So put them into your club, leave them there. It's basically a club stock and we will go and sell them afterwards. As you can see, we have just pulled ourselves the La Bomberna. This card, this went down to about 200 coins. Now you can see it's currently selling for 3,300 on a bid and you can buy it now for 3,900. So hopefully if we just do this, at 3.5 we can actually get a sale on that and that is a big chunk of coins sent back into the club uh, from what we've packed um let's go and sell this for 200 coins as well 
And again, the Chinese manager, I can't see Chinese players ever going um, or coming as an SBC Chinese player being in a promo, which will push this manager up in price. But you never know. And at the end of the day, it is a Liga, a Liga F um, card as well. I know that the league doesn't really matter because you can change the league. So it is what it is. And again, we've got the rare there. We'll put into the club. What's this new series about then? It's an old series, but we've changed what we're doing, JT. So um, all you need to do is watch the video, mate. Watch the video. There will be no edits in the video. It will be purely um, one hour long of exactly what we do on the account. Um, for 20 hours on the account, but one hour a day. So tomorrow we'll do one, the next day, the next day. So it'll last for 20 days. Um, and then we'll move on to another account. And hoping that the next account will be different to what this one will be, right? It could be a new account. It can be a poor account that's been going for a long time. You know, we want a challenge. And this is a big challenge because this account is already stocked up. It's already got so many players on the account already. So, yeah, this is a challenge. And a lot of people at this stage in the game will probably have a club like this. And they would want to know what to do from now onwards. Um Unfortunately, right now, we was expecting for future stars a load of bronze or silver players in the future star promo, which would have made opening bronze packs so much better. But unfortunately, that wasn't the case. We do have a few silvers like Alessi. Um, I can't think off the top of my head, but we do have um, a few players that um, you know we can get from silver packs. So bronze into silver upgrades. Can be okay, but if you haven't watched my previous videos on um, on the channel, then I would recommend that you do go and watch the one that I talk about upgrade packs because I am not a big fan of upgrade packs. Um, you know, it's kind of a waste of money. Um, however, there are your benefits from it. For example, you can pack yourself a promo card or a team of the week card, which is still classed as a promo. And you can also put the silvers into SBCs as well. So you do have benefits and, you know, positive things come from that. But for me, yeah, if you go watch that video, you'll understand. Um, 200 coins there. We are putting a lot of players in the club here, boys. This is looking quite good. I think this is what we're going to do for the day. Mr. Callum. Mr. Callum Calder has made it onto the YouTube video. Hey, big up for the five months, man. I appreciate you, bro. What a legend. What a legend. Five months. Top man. Thank you very much, bro, for the sub. I appreciate you. It's been a long time since. Yeah, well, you're back now, bro. You're back. To be fair, I think you've been gifted a sub recently, haven't you? I appreciate you, though, man. Right. Pricey. Yeah, honestly, man, this is going really well, boys. I'm not going to lie to you. This is going very well. So even though he's had a stocked club, we're still getting all these players into the club, which is making his club even better than what it was. Now, a lot of people will be thinking, well, why don't you just go and buy the players instead of instead of um, opening up bronze packs? Well, the difference is, if you haven't watched any of my previous BPM to Fame series or any of my other um, videos based on opening bronze packs or whatever, is that... There's a lot of cards out there that will be at a random price that you're not sure of. So there may be a player that we pack, for example, Libertadores players, that may be up at like 3k a card. The other benefit from this is that you've seen that we packed that um the Bombera Stadium. That was 3,000 coins, which means that we did get 3,000 coins back into the club if it sold. And we're going to go and check in a minute if it did sell. Um, so there's these times where you're able to get yourself a lot of coins back into the club and potentially get yourself free cards. And that's basically what we want on the account. Let's just back out. Let's go and have a look at the transfer market. Let's have a look. So there we go. We did go and sell the bomb uh, Bombonera. However you say this. Bomb Bombonera. Bombonera, Bombonera, right? This card sold. Um, if you've got it in your club, feel free to go and find it and sell it because it's right right now it's up at 3,500 coins. Um, 
lag sir like i said this is gameplay um we don't want any lag sir thank you very much ea because gameplay is horrible right now and it is very very laggy but um this card did go inside because it's eredivisie player and eredivisie players can be sold um due to the eredivisie segment of the premier or premium league um spc which i will show you right now um so if we go into his favorites i'm sure he's got it on here yeah so it's this section right here the league on and eredivisie um yeah so from this you will need to get yourself some bronze players possibly to go and chuck in there you don't need to but they're the cheapest ones to go and put in you know you don't need to use all golds and golds are 350 coins so if you can cut the price when buying for 200 coins on a bronze then obviously go and buy yourself a bronze over the visa player no worries ross mate i appreciate you buddy um so let's go and get rid of these bang and bang happy days so that's why we open up bronze packs. Also, on top of bronze packs, you can also get yourself um, a free bronze pack, which will basically be exact. I, I don't know. Wait, is it the same? I can't remember off the top of my head. It's been a long time since we've opened up bronze packs on my own personal account. I think it's been since, I don't know, properly doing BPM on the main account. Um, It's been since like October or something. Um, The reason being is because we stocked up the club that much that we didn't need to grind it again, which is, you know, insane. This Accrington Stanley kit, who are they? Exactly. Um, these should be 5,000 coins because that kit is like Argentina. What is this? Um, anyway, get rid. Um, uh, get rid of that one as well. Right. Get rid of all these. Hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is this? No. Okay. Um, and you get, like I say, you get the managers that can sell. You've got the stadiums that can sell. You can get yourself a seven player pack. Yeah, if you get yourself a seven player pack, you can never buy yourself seven uh, seven players on the market for the same price as that you'll be paying when you pack one, um, you know, through these packs because these packs are 750 coins minus the consumables, probably about 600 coins for the pack and you get seven players. That is not, you can't do that. And you get yourself a bronze pack on top of that, or you get yourself some coins. Lovely. This card can go for 200 coins. Um, and this card can go for 200 coins as well, or 250. And this manager can go for, let's see, 200 coins. So they're all going for 200 coins here. Um, actually, we'll go 250. We'll try 250 on the rares as well, uh, because they might sell for 250 after a period of time. And to be fair, we actually had a very good pack there. Very, very good pack. We had three rares in that. Jeez. I got gifted my first sub. Hey, no worries, Callum, man. No worries. So we're going to continue until, well, hopefully until the club is stocked. I'm hoping that the when we club um, stock and we are stocking up the transfer list with all these players hopefully trying to sell, um, that it doesn't ruin what he's going to be doing after we've grinded on the account. Um, hopefully not. But if for any means that he needs to go and relist, then go and relist all the cards. Just go and relist. Do what you need to do on the account. Um, and we'll just deal with the consequences when it comes to it. Um, any of these selling? I don't think they are, no. But you always, you know, it's always nice to go and check. Put them into the club. Um, right, we'll go again. Tian Yuda. Okay, Chinese players. Lovely. Going into the club. Um, okay, Maganita. I have to remember that we have got 20 hours on this account. So this is the first step, boys. This is the first step of whatever you're doing on your account and any other account. Even a brand new account, I would recommend doing this as well. Um, hang on a minute. What was that? 250? 250, right. And it's on the minutes. We'll sell for 200, boys. So yeah, on a brand new account, I would recommend open up as many bronze packs as you can um and hopefully in the next if, if you need help on a brand new account go and watch the old bpm um, to fame series all right um because our previous two a bpm to fame series one and two we do start a brand new account um and obviously this year it is different so yeah if you do want help do that and hopefully for our next our next 
part of the series. So when we use another account, um, hopefully it will be a brand new account then. So you can see in the next 20 days, um, starting a new brand new account. Because that'll be nice, switching it up. Um, Feiyu. Are we opening bronze packs for the whole hour? For me on this account, probably not because we might hit the transfer target of 100 out of 100 B-bars. Um, so if we do hit that, then we obviously have to change up what we're going to do. Um, to start with, I'm going to be opening as many bronze packs as possible just to see on how many bronze, pa uh, bronze players we can get into the club. This is a, a key part of, you know, starting a BPM to fame account or just starting a BPM account, basically. Or starting a grind. You know, it is very, very key. Um, and if you do go and pack yourself a player that can go into an Evo as well, then even better because it will be uh, probably like above 5,000 coins, right? Let's think of a menu, for example. I've never packed a menu on my main account. Never, never. And it's very frustrating, annoying, um, because I did want him first owner. However, I did go and buy him in like October um, for like 3,000 coins. And he did go up to 10K because of an Evo, but I didn't sell him because I just wanted to keep him there. Check the stadium items just in case. Um, yeah, so I've already sold one already, that um, Bombera Kai. So very, very good. Um, yeah, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep the rares and just stock them into the club for now. It's entirely up to you guys. If you guys want to go and sell your rares, feel free to do so because it will boost up um, your coin total again. Back to basically what it was. Um, why am I searching for them? Um, that one gone. That, yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I gone and sold both of these at 250 a pop, that'll be 500 back into the club. Plus that, which will be basically 616 coins back into the club with one card for free. Um, which is saving myself probably about 20 coins. Probably saving myself 20 coins, yeah. But still, um, we're saving rather than buying. And you could potentially pack yourself, like I said before, um, you know, a manager, a player that goes into an Evo, or even a stadium or a banner of some sort, a consumable, that will sell for a good chunk of coins. Um, the wild. This account is wild. Um, right, W card, 300 coins, 250. We'll sell it for 200. Again, 200. We might, leave, we might leave him a little bit. We've currently got... I know you can't see behind me, but it's 58 out of 100. So we might leave it a little bit. Um, Maybe leave him with like 10 space or something. And we'll move from there. And we will move. Right, Halbuni. 200 coins. Um, kit 300 coins. We're going to try and sell that for 200 coins and get rid of that. Terrain, it's got to be about 200 coins, right? 250, yeah, 250 there. So we'll sell him at 200. In all fairness, yeah, I really don't know why these bronze rares went up. All I can think about is I haven't looked at the Evos, right? So it could be something to do with Evos. But I do have a weird feeling it was to do with the Cannavaro SBC that came out yesterday. Um, the Cannavaro SBC, obviously, it's an icon. And all icons always require a bronze segment and a silver segment. They haven't been banging this year, bronze rares. Um, I don't know. I don't know why because the pack... Well, yeah, I do know why. It's the packs. The packs that you get back, and I will go and show you right now. The packs that you get back from the icon players um, is is not that good. Um, so a lot of people are basically sacking off. Um, yes, it does be boss. Yes, indeed. You just need to update it, mate. Update. Um, so if we go to uh, icons. So as you can see, but this Badge card looks very good, by the way. Um, so as you can see, we do have a bronze and silver segment for the icons. And they do involve, um, as you can see, or include um, rare 11 rare players. That's what you need for the requirements. And the same for the silvers. Now, like I said before, um, these SBCs in the past used to make these uh, bronze rares go up. And they probably go up to like 500 coins like they did do yesterday. And the same with the silvers. Silvers tended to go up to like 700 coins, uh, maybe even at 1k. Sometimes the bronze rares went up to a k as well. And it was banging because this is what 
um, allowed us to go and sell our players for ridiculous prices, um, especially uh, the bronze rares, right? But this year, because it gives back, you know, the small silver players pack, nobody's really bothered about that. Um, right now, this pack is probably a nice pack to try and get yourself a promo card, but still, you can only do it one time. And the same for the rest of them. This one, three common gold players, probably not worth it, right? Probably not worth it. Um, so it's exactly the same for this one. However, this one does require an 88 rated, an 87 rated, an 85 rated, which is a very cheap SBC, which means people will be completing these two if it's a cheap SBC. So um, again, you know, you need to do the bronze rares and the three. That's all I can think of. That's all I can think of um, the reason why these bronze rares went up. But again, they went up and they've come back down again. So, yeah, I'm confused. It's the same for all the icons, but I don't know. I'm confused because they've never gone up like that before. Yesterday was an exception. If we go into club, go into evolutions, we're not going to go and touch that, of course. Um, what came out yesterday, it was the FS glow up. And the FS glow up, you know, is a, it doesn't even involve anything to do with rares. Do you know what I mean, it's future stars. So, I, I, it's nothing on here, nothing on here at all. So it's got a bit confusing. I don't understand it, but hey, we move. Um, let's go and have a look at the transfer list. Let's go and see what's sold. I'm going to say that the bronze rares did sell here. Um, last year, the bronze and silver segments had tradable rares. Yeah, exactly. They were tradable as well. Um, are they not tradable this year? Was it, I'm sure they were tradable, right? They are tradable. Um, okay, so we will... I'm there. Yeah, so basically, the bronze and silver segments. Hey, Maglo, congratulations on getting yourself on the first episode of the viewers at BPM to Fame. Uh, thank you for the two months. Hey, I appreciate it, man. Um, so, yeah, the bronze and silver segments, they gave out um, a two rare gold player pack, which, you know, would be able to give you maybe and potentially a fodder card. And they were tradable. So that's why they were um, very, very good to go and complete to try and get yourself some money into the club. It was excellent. Um, Magno, how are we, man? No one knows why bronzes went up. Yeah, mate. I don't... It's frustrating. Frustrating because I always want to know so we know for next time. Um, and then, obviously, I can help you guys. But I really don't know. Um, but that's all I can think of right now. We'll go and put them into the club, boys. <laughs> oh, yes, sometimes. We was going to edit this series as well, but it's just too much. We've got another series coming as well, um, which I'm looking at doing. Hopefully, we can get it started ASAP and get a first episode out of that um, shortly as well. That one will be edited, so it will take a lot of time as well. So, yeah. Um, if you haven't already, boys, and you want to carry on watching this as well as new episodes and series, make sure you hit that subscribe button, boys, um, and get yourself involved. Um as well, on top of that, boys, anybody that is still watching this first episode right now, get a comment down below letting me know um, your type of your type of team or your type of club. Is your club uh, a mess right now? Is your club looking good? I want to know. Just let me know down in the comments, boys. Um, and also, if you do write in the comments, it will be added onto a list with um other people that are going to be commenting throughout the series and then i'll spin the wheel and if it lands on you you could be in a chance of uh, getting your account um rinse like this uh for bpm and uh yeah you'll have a stocked club at the end of it hopefully um so make sure you do that boys um forest green kit boys who's stocking up on far Who's stocking up on Forest Green kits trying to sell them at 3,500? Is that you, EA? Is that you? Is that you? Because there's one there for 200 coins. We're not liking that, boys. We're not liking that. All right. Get out of here. Get out. Mr. Ford. Sorry, pal. Um, I have done. Yeah, I have done. But I, I sometimes I don't use... Oh, hang on a minute. He's a, he's a manager. Um, sometimes... I think it's safer not to, Magno. So we'll just set that off. We fixed it. Hey, we fixed it anyway, Omar. We fixed it anyway. I swear you came in. I swear you came in after we fixed it. 
We'd have a few trouble, don't we? Uh, yo, Cash, how are we? How many coins have I made from BPM? Um, on my main account, we currently have 7 million coins. However, that isn't all. Well, I would say that's all from BPM because BPM is not just opening up bronze packs. There's so much more to do with, um, you know, to do with bronze packs um, and BPM. Through BPM, you can obviously sell the bronze players. It's great. Um, and make money if they sell. Um, you can also go and complete SBCs. When you go and complete SBCs, you will get better packs. From these better packs, you can pack better players. And these better players, let's say they're a promo card, you can go and sell them, right? So it all starts with BPM. And that's kind of the way that we look at it. When people usually come in and speak to us about uh, BPM, how much money you made, a lot of them tend to think it's just open up bronze packs and selling the bronze players. That's not what BPM is in my with my logic and my terms. Um, however, we do we did make in Black Friday, um, you know, probably over six hundred thousand coins. Um, so there's there's a good amount of total right there for you on on how many coins were made from BPM. Um, in previous months as well, going on from Black Friday, we have made a few few coins here and there. Um, obviously not a lot because I feel like EA are trying to stop us from making sales with bronze players, but we have made bits here and there. Um, I made a hundred k not too long ago, so yeah, man, it wasn't. It's it's not been too bad, not been too bad. It's a it's a time thing. It's a time thing, and with me doing this for a, a certain account, a viewer's account, that time thing will help them out because they don't have to spend time opening bronze packs. I will do it for them. Um, they don't have to spend time doing a certain SBC. I can do it for them. Uh, you know, the only thing that I won't be doing is doing any gameplay whatsoever on their account, right? All I do on the account is literally a full BPM grind. That is it. So you will see throughout the 20 hours, the, the 20 episodes that we do, exactly how we are going to be grinding. So obviously this is episode one. We're just going to be opening bronze packs for now until um, we get a good amount of players in the club, even though he already has a good amount of players in the club. And um, yeah, we're going to keep going until he has a, a transfer list of like, let's say... Uh, 90 we've, we've put a, we've put a number down of 90 uh we're gonna try and sell them at 300 coins boys um no omar not just yet maybe well, i need to set everything back up again don't i because you told me to delete everything when i didn't need to so it's annoyed me mate um not gonna lie <laughs> yeah i have to I have to reset it. It, it it took about an hour and a half to go and set it up because i didn't know what it's doing to be fair it might be a lot quicker this time because i do know what i'm doing now um but i may have forgotten so yeah Woof, 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 woof. Um, 200 coins. Yeah, BPM has took a low blow, but we've worked around it. And this is why we do this series, isn't it, Mago? Yeah, we do this series to show you guys that we can grind BPM still. Um, this kit actually looks very nice, boys. And it is selling as well. Yo. Yo. I've never seen this Regania kit before. Regania. 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 Um... I don't know. It's, it reminds me of 7-Up, boys. Hey, I like it. I like it. 7-Up kit, boys. Uh, right, 450. We'll go and sell it for 450 if we can. Or 400. We'll go 400, boys. Yes! Pro tier, what's going on, man? How are you doing, bro? Hey, W account. W account. Welcome, my man. Yes, newbie. How are we, man? How has that come through? Oh no. How has that come through? <laughs> Me personally, I would have quick sold that kit. Exactly, mate. Exactly. And this is your account, mate. What did you do to fix the freezing then? I had to um, basically, I cleaned out my PC. Cleaned out my PC. I don't know why I'm doing that. Um, I quick sold my. Uh, quick quick sold i'm talking about this i quick sold my pc boys <laughs> um i quick so <laughs> oh man quick sold is just on my brain <laughs> i cleaned my pc first it didn't fix it so i uninstalled obs and reinstalled obs and it fixed it omar um that was the problem so any time in the future i will have to um i will have to uninstall to install the app Jeez, man, that was a mouthful, boys. Um, right, two hundred. I think that's about two fifty, right? Hang on, two hundred coins, right? Sweet. Point into club. Quick side your PC. That's a hit. Yeah, man. Jeez. 
Newbie, how are we, man? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know what I'd wish, yeah? I wish that we could have all the music that we play in the stream bang it on YouTube, man. I, I wish we could, but unfortunately, there's a uh, a copyright system that YouTube absolutely hate. Uh, so if any of you guys are watching the series and you want to see it live, get yourself in the in the description down below, boys, where we'll leave all of our socials. Um, and you can come up and watch the episodes live on Twitch. Um, in between the times of 3 p.m. UK time up until 6 p.m. UK time. It's probably going to be in between 4 and 5 p.m. They're roughly the times at this moment in time. So, yeah, man, feel free to come by, boys, if you are still watching this video and this episode. And I appreciate you for um, for grinding with us. Um, 200 coins for Louis Van Gaal, by the way. Louis Van Gaal. Um, let's get rid of that. Let's have a look at this kit. Nah, dead. Uh, Cheltenham kit. Cheltenham horses. Uh, racing is in approximately 20 days, boys. Um, yeah, looking forward to it. Anybody else that watches the um, Cheltenham races, feel free to drop a comment down below, man. I love to uh, get involved with... Uh, the big racing events, Aintree and uh, Cheltenham, man. They're my go-tos. Ascot sometimes, but yeah, not too much. Uh, yes, they are, Perote, yes. Indeed, indeed, indeed. Training, bro, catch up soon. Hey, no worries, man. No worries. Play copyright-free music. Yeah, but it's not the same vibe. Do you know what I mean? Like, if I want to, if I want a little dance or a sing to a song, but there's ballerina music going in the background, do you know what I mean? I'm, it's, it's not the same vibe. <laughs> right 200 coins you know what yeah Paratir, you have got a stocked club yeah but i have been getting all of these um all these players and I i'm confused how i'm so confused how i'm getting all these players like so confused because you, we just went through your club. I suppose you've probably got more rares than you have commons in your club, right? If I'm if I'm not mistaken. Might have to go and check that um that card actually. That ball. Um two hundred coins. I right, get rid of that. Let me go and check that ball. Ah. Okay. Yeah, I use comments for daily goals and stuff. There we go, man. There we go. See, that's the thing, man. You won't have to grind the dailies as much. Obviously, um, I'm going to go and have a look in a minute to see if you have done because we are cutting time close to the 6 p.m. content. So we will go and get that done for you. Um, 350, 250. 300. 200 coins. Now, I am going to talk about a little something on this account on the first episode. Um, it's entirely up to you guys what you want to do when you go and complete the dailies, right? I'm going to give you two options. And we'll, we'll go and do that now, you know. We'll go and do that now because it is 5.06. So there might be some things that he needs to do before 6 o'clock. So I want to try and help him out on his account. We have got 20 minutes left of the video as well. So um, let me go over to the SPCs. Let's just go and double check because he might have done it last night. Might have done it last night. Let's have a look. Um, so upgrades. Let's see. We've got the daily goals here. Um, how many does he need to go and complete? Okay, you only need one more to go and do. W, right? So there's two ways to go and complete the bronze and the silver challenge. If you've got the amount of coins that he does on his account, I would advise you guys not to use the players in your club that you've been grinding through BPM, right? From opening bronze packs. Now you might be thinking, why not use the players that you've been putting into your club? Surely that's the reason why you're using or opening bronze packs to go and put them into this, right? The reason why I would keep them in your club is because if the price ever goes up on these cards, you've got them in your club already and you can go and sell them. Whereas if you go and put them into this SBC, completely forgetting about using that card in the SBC, then if it goes up in price, you won't have the card, right? Which means you won't be making the money. So instead of using the players that you have in your club, go and buy them off the market for 150 coins each. Then what you can do is you can go and complete these segments, right? Now, obviously, your money is going to be going down. 
But on top of this, you will be getting yourself the small bronze player pack and you will be getting yourself the small silver players pack. It's entirely up to you if you want to go and open these straight away or go and keep them. If you go and open them straight away, you can easily go and use these cards back into the next run of this SPC, um, which will obviously minimize the price um, when you go and buy the next set of players. So all I'm going to do, um, which you might not want me to do, okay, but I'm going to do it because it's my way of grinding the account um is and we do have time is i am going to go and bid on a load of these players um so we'll go and bid okay go and bid and we can do this for silvers as well and we've been doing it on on my account or i've been doing it on my account nearly every single day apart from after team of the year i um haven't done it since right so it's been about two weeks um that I haven't been doing it because of certain reasons uh we've still got over 1000 packs on the account we've still got over 300 silver packs to open we've still got over 300 bronze packs to open um that we've saved so yeah very very um annoying that we've still got those packs but hey we're we're, we're cooking and we're moving okay 150 can you by any chance buy 287s and do the 87 party bag uh no you're gonna have to do that part here you will be able to do it mate because we've got 20 minutes left on this account which means it'll be half past five which means you've got 30 minutes to go and do it yourself um i would do it for the content but because this is the bpm to fame series um you know it's not how i would grind it um we would have to go and pack that card you know so yeah um so let's go and get these players boys now the best way to go and buy these cards would 100 percent be to go onto um, your web app and go and bid on the web app. Now there is an extension um, called Pale Tools. I'm not gonna promote it in the description down below. Just remember the name, Pale Tools. Go and search it, get it as an extension onto your web app and you can literally go and um, complete SBCs very quickly. You can see what players you've already got in your club because as you've seen, I've gone and bought players that um, we've already got in the club which makes it very annoying um so yeah make sure you do use that to go and complete spcs and that way you can go and buy the players that you don't already have um so we're going to go and put them into the club there we're going to go on to spc and we're going to go to the daily gold bronze challenge how do I participate? Um, what do you mean by how do you participate, mate? How, what do you mean, Caden? Um, right, newest. We just go bang. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we'll go and get the other two as well. Like, the now the thing you're doing for this guy... Oh, so you want me to do it for you, Caden? Is that what you're asking? Oh, wait, hang on. What's going on here? Transfers. Okay, go and put them in. Yeah? Well, we're going to do 20... Oh, no. Who was the player, boys? Uh, was it Zhang Chong? Oh, boys, I've forgotten who the player was. Oh, no. I've had a nightmare. Um, so I think it was I think it was the Chinese bloke, right? Villain, villager. Okay, he's straight in. All right, let's try this. So basically, we're going to be doing twenty hours on this account, Caden, um, and then we're going to choose somebody else in which will be in twenty days. So the whole grind will probably be very similar, but depending on what's out, it could be different, right? Could be different. You never know. Um, so yeah, man, it'll be different. It was, yeah, lovely. So yeah, if you want to part, if you want to try and get involved, Caden, for your account, then you will need to go and watch the video and uh, listen to the video, um, and watch the video. Basically, it'll tell you what to do to try and get yourself involved. Um, so what we're gonna do is newest, and put them in there, lovely jubbly, and go and buy, and put them in. Go and buy. We've already bought them. <laughs> go and put them in there like that. Right. So now we've got a bronze pack. Go and open up that bronze pack if you really want to. I'm going to open it. Actually, do we open it? Do we open it? I feel like we're going to get dupes. 
it is a tradable pack as well, right? So you can, if you do get someone good, then you can get something back. Hey, Jenny, thank you for the 20 bits. Appreciate you. Here we go. So these are not really worth opening right now because it would be better to go and open up these when there's um when there's promo cards, right? And this is what I was hoping for. I was hoping for future stars to have bronze players or team of the weeks, which we may see some team of the bronze team of the weeks. You never know. Um, so if you do, then these are the time to go and open them when there's a promo card. Because you could potentially pack a, let's say, a team of the week player, which would be 20k coins. Banging, which we've done in the past. Um, on top of that, if there is a promo with a bronze player in it, you get yourself a promo card, which may be another 10k coins back into the club. So me, I it, it's ideally to or it's ideal to to hold on to these packs, but if you're not really a hold holder on bronze packs and silver packs, then yeah, feel free to just rip them and put them into your club. As you can see, again, 250 coins. You know, we'll go and sell them for there. We'll put them into the club and Pyatir or myself can go and um, use those cards on the next one. But like I said before, boys, if you go and use them, then you will have to go and buy them back to put them back into your club for the next time or try and pack them, um, especially if there's ever something that will make them go up in price. Same for the silver challenge. Silver challenge um, it needs the silvers. So we are going to go and buy the silvers. Um, and silvers should be the same. Um, hang on a minute. Let me do this. Okay. So 150. 150. And you might be thinking, why are you buying these cards now? Why don't you go and use the bronzes that you've been um, putting into your club? The bronze that you've been putting into your club, why don't you just go and put them into upgrade SBCs? Again, like I said earlier on, go and check out my uh, my video that I've got on the channel to do with League SBCs. Um, I can't actually remember what playlist it's under right now on the top of my head. It might be under the method section, not too sure. Um, but yeah, you'll see it on my channel if you just scroll down a little bit. It wasn't too long ago where I mentioned about um, why I don't put bronzes into upgrade packs. So we have got to bought a few players there. It's better to go and buy um, a lump sum and then you can just go and do bang, 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 rather than come on here, bang, come on here, bang, buy, bang, buy, bang, right? It's better if you just go buy, 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 and then bang, 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 simple as. Um, so as you can see there, we do have three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven when they go through. Lovely. Um, transfer targets. We'll do this, back out. What's the end goal for that account? The end goal for this account? Um, the end goal for this account is whatever Pirateer wants, mate. Whatever he wants. It will it will be beneficial for him, himself, to go and grind SBCs and to basically help him get whatever he wants on the account. So as you can see, we did get more for 1, 000, uh, 150, which is a total of... 1,600 coins or 1,650. And on top of that, on top of that, um, we do also have the, the cost of the bronzes. So we spent about 3,000, 3,300 coins. Yeah. To get ourselves, to get ourselves, let me show you. To get ourselves six bronze players, six silver players and 11 gold players so um uh, that for me is a a w now obviously i'm going to go and clear that squad and we are just going to do newest and bang all these in there's no point using those players because with you know they are 74 rated players and you never know you might need 74 rated players somewhere else down the line you never know what EA is going to release either. EA could randomly go and release uh, a random SVC that will push those 74 rated players up, even though they are off league. They could even release a friendly game. They could even release a promo like they did before, the silver promo that they released before, where you're going to need to use silver players. And some of these silver players could be the best players that you have to go and use. Um, and, and then when you go to buy them, they're already up at 5k. And you're not going to go and buy them then. Now you've already got them in your club. Um, so as you can see, we have gone and completed that. We did go and get them. Now, I don't know what else he wants to be done on the account. Now, I do know that we do need one day 
to go and get Davies. And I'm telling you now, Pyatir, yeah, that this um, needs to be completed. This needs to be completed. He has to go and complete the 87 rated squad and, well, two 87 rated. Davies is one of the best left backs on the game. And as an SBC, it's an absolute banker to go and do. So if you haven't completed this already and you're watching this video before, obviously, it expires, um, then crack on with it. Get it done ASAP because this card is so good in game. Um, obviously, he did want to go and uh, complete this. To, you know, he's got 85s in his club, but he hasn't got 287s, which is an L. I would, obviously, he does want to try and get this done before um, 6 o'clock as well. So he's got 30 minutes himself to get this done. Um, the 85 plus player pick. Um, we're not going to grind that right now. We're not going to grind that because we're still at the very start. Right. So um, looking at what we've been putting into the club. I suppose we could start um, putting or completing some of these for him. Um, I suppose for the next 10 minutes, we could go and complete this. Um, so what we're going to do is we are going to go and get the MLS. I always have my set players, but we did switch it up. We did switch it up massively. Where's MLS? Um, and we are going to go... Actually, we'll just search this. We'll search. He could already have the players in his club. Forsberg... Wait, hold up. He's actually moved. Yo. Okay. We've got some new players, boys. We have got some new players. And he is untradeable. I've never... I haven't seen... We haven't grinded League SBCs in a minute because of how many packs we've got on our main account. Um, so these players have been moving around. Um, we are going to put ourselves a few players in here. Um, Mr. Blake in gold as well. Hey, this is a W. Um... Okay, we'll do that and that. Um, okay, we'll we'll go and put five. We'll go and put five in there. So we'll put Jao Paulo and we'll go and use Carlos Skill as well. Okay, he can go there. Hey, this is looking lovely. W's. Okay. Now, what we need to do is we do need six rares. So we're going to go and get our bronze rares. And this is where we will be using the players that we have been... When we've been opening bronze packs, we will be using these bronze rares, right? So obviously that's going to be on. Um, and we are going to be going on to the MLS section. It doesn't need to be MLS. You know, it could be somewhere. It could be um, championship as well. But we are just going to go and lob these in here like this. Um... I don't know if they need to be 64. We'll work that one out because obviously we've used higher rated players. Um, and we'll lob him in there as well. Uh, 74 rating, right, sweet. So we do need a higher rated player there. I'm going to go and use... Uh, let's go and use gains. Okay, can we up that a little bit? Or down that a little bit, should I say? Can we down it? Uh, another 63... What is it? It is, I think, I could do that, right? Yeah. And if you need to go and buy, boys, feel free to go and buy for this one, right? Because it is dead cheap. But obviously, doing BPM will help it um, with the cost of things. Um, right, so there you go. Wait, I don't know why I put in a 61 rated. Hang on a minute. I'm tripping. I was meant to put in that. Uh, okay. Boom. There we go. Can we get him one more? Got Mr. Neil there. Ah, oh, no, because it's Ale Ale. All right, sweet. So we're going to go with that, boys. So as you can see, we got uh, three 84s and three 63s. And we're using an 80, two 79s, and a 78 and a 76. And that will do it, boys. That will do it. All right, simple as. Bang. Um, Go and send that. And that is the cheapest way of going to complete it because bronze is here are at... Um, Let me just go and show... The compare price these will be at probably well as you can see this one's up a little bit but um you might be able to get them on bid for about 150 to 200 coins and the gold commons you should be able to go and pick up for around about 350 to 400 coins rather than 700 coins for a rare so we'll go and send that one boys w's there is a pack right there 
Um, okay, so we'll go and open up these in a minute. Um, we've got this one as well. So once again, we'll go and use the players in our club. So we've got Serie B. Um, we'll go for bronze rares first. We'll just go bang and bang. Happy days. Centre mid. Striker. So this one is a 62 rated overall. We're looking good on this one. Uh, we'll go high. Why not? We'll just go and lob all these here. On there. And then we'll um, sort them into their places. Evening Trotty. How are we son? Right. Let's go and put these in. So we have a 63 there. A cam here. Oh, okay. Oh, you can go right mid W. Go up top. That should do it for the chemistry. So we can just bong these in wherever we want now. Uh, we need different though. So this guy can go here. This guy can go here. Uh, this guy can go here. W. Can't use that team, right? We can use this team. Okay, we'll switch up to go to Bundesliga. Bundesliga, and we'll go bang and bang. That should do it. Oh, maybe not. We need a higher rating. Okay. Need a higher rating, boys. We've got this geezer. There we go. Can we switch them out? Yeah. Okay, there we go. So we'll run it like that. I'm just going to go and check the prices because you never know. One of them may be up. Obviously, he's untradeable, so that's a W. Um, and if they are up, then obviously we want to go and sell them and use someone else. Simple as that. I know a lot of you guys will just go and put them in. Um, but for the for the case of the video, here we go. Look, I nearly put in a seven K player into an SBC, boys. I nearly put in a seven K player into an SBC. Yeah, and this is why you need to go and check, boys. Uh, we are going to go and drop him to six three. Uh, let me go and check the rest. Make sure that just that is why we check our players, boys. All right, that is why we check, and I'm glad that's just happened in this first episode, just to prove to you guys that we should be checking the players that we put into the SBCs. W that if it sells. Hopefully by the end of the video it will sell, uh, which is in approximately three minutes. Um, right, so we will go and put this uh, goalkeeper back in there. It's two hundred coins. Like I said. If you do need to go and buy a player or a couple of players to go and finish off an SBC, feel free to do so. I know that you will need to go and buy the gold cards for the um, MLS and for the second, the, the, sorry, the third segment, which is the League 2, you will need to buy gold cards for these two. Um, and on top of that, um, you may need to go and buy players for this Libertadores SBC segment. Um, so what I'm going to do for this one is if you've watched my previous videos of how to complete this the best on the methods, what I like to do is I like to scroll through the club until we find um, a club with six players or more um preferably players that are players that are bronze rating um or low rated silvers reason being is because the higher rated silvers we want to be putting into the premium league sbc segment um so i think we did find one there actually to do whatever the best way to go and complete this as well is to go and buy, boys. Go and buy 150s on this um, additional players. So we could use the five and then go and buy another one. But I do feel like we do have um, something around here that we can just go and use instead. Um, I can't remember what team it was now. Was it that team? No. There was a team then that we flicked past. This team? Okay, yeah, this team. Here we go. So we'll bang, 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 bang. Lovely. And we will go and check the price of these players as well, boys. As always. Um, let's do this quickly. Okay, he's untradeable. Lovely. He's untradeable. What am I doing? He's not untradeable. Let's see. Prices. 300, that'll do. 
Okay, untradeable. 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 Lovely. So he's got untradeable players. So love that. Uh, right. Now we want to go to low to high. And we are just going to go and flick through some of these. Mm -hmm. Again, it'd be better if you just go and buy, boys. Right? Just go and buy. Go and buy the additional players. Okay. I'm just going to use what's in the club for now. Um, probably not the best idea. We do use two from the same club and two from the same club here. But like I say, this segment, you can go and buy. It obviously, if you go and pack them, great. But yeah, go and buy. Right, send that one, boys. Lovely. And there we go. That is completed. That has helped his club a little bit. Um, so we are going to go and open them to end the video, boys. That is a W episode one on uh, the viewer's account. Um, let's go and open up the... Let's go and open up these packs first. Let's go and open up these packs first. These are tradable packs as well. So if we do get ourselves a future star, that'll be buzzing for this video. Um, as you can see, it's not. Or even a team of the week. Team of the week would be amazing. You get a lot of coins back. Um, w. Absolute W and a half. That is insane. Okay. Now what you can do is you can go and sell these cards. For me personally, I'm not going to go and sell them. I'm just going to chuck them into the club. Um, reason being is because we're, we need to end the video. Okay, we can go and look through them another time or Partey can deal with these another time. All right, so we will go and lob that up there. Um, next one. Okay, what's in this? No worries, Partey. Um, again... You know, probably some W cards here. We get um, an MLS player, which we don't need to use because we use bronze and golds. Again, some players that potentially can be sold. Um, how much is this? Yeah. Okay. Love him up there. Partey can deal with him as well. Um, I don't know why that's just popped up in the bottom right-hand corner. I can't get rid of it. Right. Gold pack tradable. Nothing. Cameroon. Striker. Uh, is that cheap promoting? Oh, I don't even know. Who's this? Oh, Abby Baker. Okay. I'll be Baker. <sighs> he might as well be a Baker. Shit me. Okay. Um, Mateta. It could be sold. Again, put them up there for now, boys, because we're running against the clock. And next one. Not looking too good. Hang on a minute. Ah, oh, no, it's an 83 raid, I think. Is it 83 rated? 83 rated Auburn. If it is the 83, yeah. 83 rated Auburn. Not too bad. It's an 83 rated card, boys. And an 82. Uh, two 82s. An 81. 80. Yeah, that is not too bad. I would take that. That one is untradeable, which means we are going to have to stay there um, and let Pioteer deal with that card. Um, guys, that is a W first episode. If you have enjoyed the episode and you want to come back and see episode two of the viewers BPM to fame, Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you like this video. Comment down below. Remember to do that as well if you want a chance of your account to be the next account that we grind for 20 hours. Um, and yeah, will be another video uploaded tomorrow. Stay tuned and I'll see you there. Peace.